Hey, so I want to make a video here real quick, just kind of going over my bike. Um, you know, as a lot of people that know me know, I'm into mountain biking. And uh, it's one of the reasons I wanted to start the YouTube channel. Um, but I really wanted to do a quick, just kind of walk around on uh, what's going to be, I guess, my weapon of choice this year. Um, so I went ahead and picked up a Giant Talon II. They were on sale um, for just under $600, which for a one-by drivetrain, um, hydraulic brakes, um, front and rear disc, obviously, um, you know, is, is a pretty good deal. Um, nice Maxxis tires. So just kind of, you know, going over the front here. Um, the only thing really I changed, um, did take off the factory grips and uh, put on some WTB ones. Um, I did add a dropper post. That was really one of the the first things I wanted to do. So I picked up a PNW dropper, threw that on there. Um, my phone mount, I use a quad lock. Um, it's, you know, low profile. So if I'm on a crazier trail, I obviously don't mount my phone. Um, and it, you know, I can leave that on there really. It doesn't take up much room. Um, kind of coming down the front of the bike. Uh, next upgrade I really want to do is change out the factory SR Suntour coil fork. Um, I think changing it out and doing some tubeless tires is really about all I'm going to do to this bike, you know, with the exception or with the, with the dropper post. So as we kind of come back, like I said, got everything internally routed for the dropper. Um, the dropper, I believe it's a 120 mil. Don't quote me on that. Um, but it does have, you know, a pretty good bit of travel um, for, you know, all the way down and, of course, all the way up with the flick of a button. Um, as we work on the way back or on the way down, I did pick up some PNW pedals. Um, they have been awesome. Um, I picked them up. I got them on sale when I bought the droppers, so I figured why not at the time, you know, needed, needed some better pedals anyway. Um, as we come back, like I said, it is a micro shift advent, um, one by nine with the clutch derailleur. Um, so that has been nice, you know, limiting dropped chains on the trail. Um, all in all, like I said, you know, really good, really good bike for, for the price. Um, especially, you know, I was able to pick it up on sale. Um, you know, just what you can get for a bike nowadays, um, you know, as before, you know, I, I still remember like disc brakes really kind of being on bikes under a thousand dollars. And then now it seems like you can pick them up on bikes under $300. Um, obviously, you know, it is nice to have the hydraulic brakes. Oh, forgot to mention like $3 on Amazon, just some little rubber sleeves to put on the brake levers. And they have actually freaking been awesome. I love them. Um, and also I guess kind of going hand in hand with the pedals is I did pick me up some 510 trail cross mountain bike shoes and the pairing of them with those pedals have been top notch um, really like that so yeah that's that's kind of my setup um, it's working great for me so far here in central Ohio um, I'm looking to probably get another full suspension mountain bike next year to have you know for the more technical or hardcore trails we go especially when we go back to west virginia but a hardtail man it's you know for the money that you can get one um they're great to learn on great to get a workout in um and just get out and hit the trails and that's better than than nothing at all so you'll be seeing me riding this one primarily really this year um gravel and path riding i do have a gravel bike um a poseidon x and i will make a separate video on that um just because a lot of people always ask me about it because it's you know it's a direct consumer brand so um be looking for a video on that soon probably shoot that uh really f you know first couple times i get it out um when i remember to uh so yeah the giant talent 2 i will put a link down in the description below um price again may vary based on model year um, and all of them are just a little bit different, but, um, I think the giant talent is a awesome series and, uh, great for people either a looking to get started in mountain biking or pick up a mountain bike. Um, a hard tail to have as a, you know, as like a, just a get out everyday bike. So thank you for checking out the channel. Um, like subscribe, drop a comment below if you have a talent too, or if you're looking to get into mountain biking, um, would love to share beginner tips, tricks, anything like that with you guys. So 
look forward to, you know, talking to you guys more and uh, keep looking out for more videos to come.